the project I have is a Yamaha 653 trombone. This is a really nice, nicely made horn. And I love that older Yamaha logo. What we're doing with this is a gentleman brought this in and it had the original lacquer finish, but he had me do a trumpet, a Yamaha trumpet of his some years ago in a scratch brushed finish, then lacquered and he just loved it so he wanted to have the trombone done that way and so here you see the lacquer has been uh, stripped uh, some spots are shiny some I've already scratched up a little bit but I used a hot strip tank with a water-based stripping agent and uh, I basically took a 15 gallon uh, drum and cut a hole in it so that I could put a heating element in it takes a while for that to get hot uh, with a 2000 watt heating element but it does the job takes takes a little while but it does a nice job stripping the lacquer and then it's going to be finished like this in the satin the satin finish I don't know if you can get a the satin um, scratch brushed finish and that will be lacquered clear coated to protect it so it won't tarnish and all the nickel and brass pieces are going to be like that. And here you can see the slide. The slide section came out just beautiful. Of course, we left the water key its bright nickel. But the rest of it was abraded. I'm going to get this down into a, a background that's less noisy. <laughs> scratch brushed and I've got three clo coats of lacquer on this um, anyway that's what the whole thing is going to look like I'll put up an after picture of the entire horn and a um, lot of inquiries about refinishing horns they want can I have my tr trumpet overhauled or how much is it to overhaul my trumpet or refinish my trombone and the bottom line in that is it's usually pretty expensive but if you choose to have a scratch brush type finish like this the time that is saved in buffing is incredible there, there, it, so we can do a job like this for a fraction of what it would cost to have a full overhaul done it's probably going to be you know well less than half it's <laughs> well less than half so anyway but that's an idea for you if you want to have an instrument refinished please contact me at the information provided in the description thank you here it is the final product the scratch brushed and lacquered yamaha 653 beautiful trombone um really a neat finish very economical way to refinish an instrument as compared to a traditional overhaul where you're bright buffing everything and part of the reason is um, the abrading that you do to the brass um, will mask a lot of microscopic pits that you would normally try and sand out and then buff out and what I do with this is I start with of course stripping the lacquer then taking all the little dings and dents out that may be in it and there was quite a few in this tuning slide and that turned out real nice but um, removing in the, also in the hand slide there was quite a bit of uh, pitting from the person's body chemistry and the acids and oils in their hands so I start with getting the dings and dents out of it then doing some sanding and, and hard buffing but I don't have to take the hard buffing quite to that <laughs> actually not even near the level that you do to do this in a mirror finish um, that is an incredible amount of time uh, this takes a significant less time and thereby a significant savings to you the customer again it's a beautiful finish this has come into vogue in the last 20 years um, of course you saw back in the 80s and the early 90s that raw finish that Wynton Marcellus, for example, is using on his trumpet, the Monette trumpets. It's a similar idea, right? 
um, but because it's lacquered, it's not gonna it's not gonna tarnish out and get water spotted like uh, like it would with a completely raw finish. It also could be nickel plated or silver plated, and if you had money, <laughs> you could have this gold plated. So if you silver plated this, you would get that nice satin silver look, uh, brushed look in silver plating. So there's all kinds of options beyond the traditional overhaul. Um, anyway, again. Uh, You've got the contact information there. I'd be glad to help you out if you're interested in doing a trumpet or trombone or or what you might have in this kind of a kind of a finish. All right, thanks for watching. And if you like, uh, pass it on and show other people. And please just leave a comment. That really helps to have just one comment. You know, it can be very brief. Thanks.